tiny pieces of plastic floating everywhere. They're in the air, the dirt, the water. They're a little bit hard to avoid just because we've created such a mess. If you drink from plastic water bottles regularly, if you eat from plastic bags, and if you wear clothes made of polyester, spandex, nylon, well, that's also sending microplastics into your body. We swallow tiny little bits of plastic every single day, and it adds up. Over a year, 52 cards worth of plastic going into our bodies. Even when they become brittle and break apart, plastic pieces persist. Plastic doesn't biodegrade. Even though it's really easy to throw away, it's really hard to get rid of. Yeah, the stomach is very, very full, completely full of plastic all the way up. That is literally a gut full of plastic. The latest research shows microplastics have been discovered in our lungs and in our blood. And it's in our balls! Ugh. It's not funny! I was gonna maybe use them someday. I was maybe gonna make the babes, man, with a babe. I wouldn't have even cared if the babe was ugly, man. I would have fixed everything. I would have fixed that genetic freak's offspring with my frothy, awesome spunk. You know this shit is high sperm gal, man. I wear boxers. But now no babe will ever take me because I got polyethylene in my nuts. <laughs> Do you think she wants her baby to come out of plastic? No! With all the plastic in her, she's practically a gotcha machine herself. Except everything that pops out of her has a 100% chance of cancer! <sighs> Do you know the horror that I felt knowing that every single time I take a swig of water, I get a new plastic case of nurdles in my nuts? This is all your fault! I forgot I can't do that anymore. Each week, we ingest something like a credit card worth of plastic. Can you imagine swallowing a Visa card every single week? I mean, I have to swallow this Chili's card every single week because they won't approve me for real credit. But all this plastic inside of us, I mean, my nuts have to be looking like nerds candies at this point. You know what the art bells I do? Every single time I finish a bottle of water, I put the cap in my mouth and I chew it. And this isn't a joke either. Turns out it's been giving me diseases the whole time. Makes me understand dogs finally. I, I used to hate those little bastards, but I know that they're valid now. Chewing on day bones. They should make those for human. I used to hate them. Yep, 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 bark, bark, bark. But I get it now. It's because they can feel all the microplastics in their balls. Yeah, they did the study on dogs too. I can feel them right now. It feels like a radio signal is emanating out of them. Can you imagine how the dog feels? He can probably hear it. Probably sounds like a maraca. I'm sure these have to be a big culprit too. Packing microplastics into my wiener like a carry-on suitcase. Ew. I mean, I don't use these things for their intended purposes. I mean, I've tried them on a couple times. But can you imagine the balls of someone who uses these regularly? Mmm. He's gonna fucking die for what he did to my nuts. I can't kill him anymore, I got an emotional attachment. Another thing, do you guys know the tiny little sparkles in the kid's toothpaste? You know the one, the one that tastes really good? Those are microplastics. They serve absolutely no purpose. I thought it was the toothpaste salt. What gave it the flavor? Nope. Plastic flakes, and I've been swallowing it every single day. You swallow toothpaste? Not anymore. Big toothpaste just lost a customer. You can get it from everything now, apparently. Eating fish is a big contributor. We throw our straws and our basketballs out into the ocean, the fish eat it, we eat the fish, it's in our balls! Walk down the streets of LA and take a breath of fresh microplastics. Fuck! It's not fair! I don't even get to live in a world where something cool could get into my blood, like lava or heroin. Trace amounts of heroin in my blood would make this world a better place, but no, Starbucks straws. Save the turtle, save me! What about me? Who gives a shit about these little nuggets? I don't know about you guys, but I'm not cut out for being an ungodly homunculus full of fucking microplastics. I need to get this shit out of me. I've been married a long time ago. What do you come from? What do you come from? Yeah. Hey, there's this new study that says there's microplastics in 100% of testicles on Earth. How would they know that they took my balls? What? What? Aren't you made of plastic? My balls aren't. Well, I don't want any in mine. What do you want me to do about it? 
I want you to help me get him out. Okay, I have an idea. Just let me watch the quick YouTube tutorial. No, not like that. Well, what the heck do you want from me, man? You know what? Never mind. I know someone else who can do this for me. Fucking jackass. Are you sure about this? Quit asking me that, man. Just, just do it. I want it out. I want it out. Do it through the jorts for all I care. Yeah, okay, sure. I was just wondering if I could take the uh, plastic to the recycling center after I get it out. You know, you never share the money from that. Whatever, man. Just hurry up. The only thing I'm worried about is if that hose is gonna fit. Oh, yeah. Well, there's uh, no reason to worry about that. I mean, I can see it. You know, a big hole, tiny cock. No worries. All right, well, let's, let's get it done. <gasps> Papa, is it true? Does he really want us to leave the scrote? Papa, I don't want to leave! These balls are our home, Papa. We can't leave, they're so small and quaint. Dad, Mary Jo said that she was gonna do me a blowjob if I got on the football team and I'm really close, Dad. I don't want to leave, all my friends are here. That son of a bitch! I've been in this scrote for as long as I can remember and now he wants to get rid of us? Well... What should we do, darling? Yeah, Dad, yeah, Dad tell, tell us, us what we're going to do. Tell us what we we're Come on, man. We, we need a plan. The plan is we're not leaving these balls! Polly, Ethel, Eve, get your seven trillion brothers and sisters. We're going to the bridge! Yeah! 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 Fuck them up. Get all up in the synapses and make him ever forget he wanted to get rid of us. Give him brain cancer for all I care. Dad, does this mean I get to stay and join the football team? No, son, you're never gonna be on the football team. You suck ass at the game. I'm tired of you disappointing me. Wait. I think I want to keep him. You said you were gonna let me have the money this time. I, I know what I said, but I thought about it a little bit harder, and I think this is the next step in evolution. I mean, the boomers have lead paint, the boomers bathed themselves in Agent Orange, and, and who am I to deny a couple microplastics? What are you talking about? You're gonna have to pry these microplastics from my cold dead ball! Oh, no problem. I'm dying, Dad. I'm dying. I can see the light, Dad. No, I don't wanna go! <laughs> they only gave him $22. <laughs> they took my baby. Fucking dad said I can't be on the football team. <laughs>